Even during the weekly meeting between the nation's leader and top aides, officials mourned the passing of the former labor activist. According to our Cha Sang Mi, the president had nothing but praise for the man who helped keep the government in check from the opposite side of the political aisle. Following the sudden death of Doe Tan, a prominent opposition lawmaker who committed suicide earlier on Monday, Seoul's top office sent its condolences to the deceased. President Moon shared the news with his top aides just before he sat down for a weekly meeting. Doe Tan, my sadness is really heartfelt and heartbreaking. Doe Tan, my sadness is President Moon praised the late lawmaker's career, saying No had made big contributions to widen the political arena and played a large role in improving the dignity of political discussions with his calm words. The South Korean leader sent condolences to the late lawmaker and his family, as well as to the Justice Party, which No was a member of. The meeting came after the Blue House spokesperson told the press that the presidential office decided to cancel President Moon's Q&A session on Facebook Live, which had been scheduled for just before noon, following the sorrowful incident in the morning. The presidential Blue House sent a notification on Twitter that the planned reply session to a petition had been delayed and it will be led by the president's senior communications secretary, Yoon Young-chan, instead on Tuesday. Cha Sang-mi, Arirang News.